Uh, hello everyone, Mike Arnold here, co-founder of Pat Trading Partners along with Bob Igino. No crypto videos for a couple days because it literally hasn't done anything. We're watching this for the uh, potential double top to watch for a bigger pullback, turn into a triple top. That's all done at this point. And it's essentially moved sideways in a rather large range. Key resistance area we're watching is about 81, 83. Uh, first level of key support we're watching is about 75, 75. And then if we broke through there, we'd be looking down around 71, 75. Levels the upside are still the same. Remember, if you need shorter term levels, you can always use the you know, the mini GAN boxes, like if you were looking for shorter levels up there, you could then convert that to a 12 and a 25. You could come down here and convert that again to a 12 and a 25, like that. If you're looking for the levels, uh, just the minor levels on any up move or down move. So those are the things that you'll be wanting to do once it breaks out of this range. Let's take a look at that daily chart daily chart so rising rotation zone coming at about 73.26 so on a base off a daily basis i really be watching about the 73.85 area with the convergence of the rotation zone looks like right now we're upwards of forming a triple top which slightly favors a continuation pattern but this is losing momentum pretty rapidly so i'd wait for a key breakout one way or the other um that's about it for bitcoin switch over to ethereum so it keeps getting stalled out and then this came down to validate any upper levels from this sloppy double bottom so at this point very key resistance coming in but 260 key support the level we're watching is right about 232 so close above 260 bullish, close below 232 bearish, just moving back and forth in here, flat rotation zone. So nothing else really to do unless another pattern comes up, but it's trading both sides of the range at this point. So we check in on the daily chart. You see it's dip in the rotation zone, but close back above the eight. So the eight still holding bottom of the rotation zone coming in right now. I'd be watching the spike low about 230 and that converging with the spike low. So if we did move down and we close below that, that's uh, the bigger picture bearish case, bigger picture bullish case. I'd be watching for a close above about 265 above these candle bodies. And then we have the next levels which have not changed higher. Again, really quick update because not much is going on in Ethereum and Bitcoin. And we'll talk to everyone soon. Bye for now.